this fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's, a, that's a really cool thumbnail. Who's watching? Who's Alright, so we drove this thing uh, 700 miles almost on the dot here, and uh, we haven't even got out of the car yet, and we're gonna make a pass. Both of us <laughs> in it, full road trip mode, just send it. All right, here we go. First Supra 2020 Supra down the drag strip. This thing spun like crazy. Woo, all right. That was sick. Dude, that was a crazy pass. <laughs> It was wild. Yeah, it got a little, it got a little squirrely. Oh, I yeah. think the tires were still a little wet when we came through. Uh, this like it was like a water puddle here. Yeah. We got a. Now we'll get serious. That was road trip mode. We still have like 50 pounds of stuff in the back, so we're gonna pull everything out and get serious, warm the tires up for real, and send this thing down the track. So Nick, I think we're officially the first two people to make an official drag strip pass in a 2022 Supra. That's How pretty awesome badass, that man. That's crazy. <laughs> So red. We went 14-0, but I'm not proud of it. Hey, there's two of us in there. We spun. <laughs> hey, we extra, had the trunk full. Extra couple, two to three hundred pounds in there. So, oh yeah. And it spun pretty bad. Yeah. Still an awesome we'll, experience, we'll, man. We'll give it another shot. Oh yeah. So what do you think, man? 700 miles. It's pretty crazy, dude. Drives pretty good, right? Oh yeah. Um, over overall, I think I'm I'm pretty impressed. I am too. I'm, I'm pretty impressed. I, I don't know. I, I think it might be safe to say that uh, we've had the most miles driven in a 2022 Supra. I think that'd I think, be accurate. I, I don't know anybody yeah. else that's <laughs> driven one almost a thousand miles already. Very true. <laughs> I think it's got potential. I thought it was. It's. It turned out to be a lot cooler than I expected it to be for sure. So it's. It's not very big on the inside. It wasn't bad at all. Yeah, it, it really was a, wasn't it was bad. A comfy trip and a ton of fun. Oh yeah. I'm ready to race this thing? Hell yeah, man. <laughs> 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 Where do you guys want me to spray this thing? What do we think? I'll do a small burn out of the back.
Try to control it off. All right, so those last two passes, you said you tried turning traction control off. Yeah, I've tried a bunch of stuff. So launch control, traction control off, traction control on. Um, if you try to foot brake it, like, it wants to spin. Yeah. And it's automatic, so once it starts spinning, you kind of just lose it. So with the traction control on, like, it's pretty good. It's not very, like, invasive. It actually works really well. It's, like, a nice performance traction control. It works pretty good. Um, you try putting it in second? I tried launching it in second, and it was a little better, but I, I did that with traction control off, and it cut a better 60 foot, but then once it got, like, 60 feet out, it broke loose. Yeah. But this thing with some drag radials will probably go 11. So. Oh, for sure. Yeah, so we'll do that. Just let it cool off. See what it can do. You're fucking... <laughs> <laughs> like that's, a, that's a really cool thumbnail. Right now, <laughs> are you watching? Who's watching? Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> Launch control. So, oh, sport. That's it. We're ready to go. Boom. Pretty exciting day. My boy Javier picked up our 2020 Supra, drove straight from Georgia like nine hours, uh, and came straight to the track to see what it would do. We wanted to be one of the first ones to see what the car was capable of. Um, my initial impression, the car is beautiful. It looks a lot better in person. It's bigger. Uh, it doesn't look as small as it does in a lot of the pictures. It drove great. It sounds good. It's, it's a really well put together car. Um, we were able to get it to go a 12.5 at 109. 12.5 at 109. Yeah, 12.5 at 109. But it desperately needs some traction. So, like, if you try to use the traction, or if you put the traction control off, or you try to use the launch control, it just has no I shot. So, tomorrow, we're going to be back, right into Motorsports Park, first thing in the morning. We're going to go put some drag radials on this thing, put it on the launch control, and I think that's going to make a huge difference. And see if we can't get this thing to go low twelves or whatever. We'll just yeah, see what it does. See what it does. Yeah. yeah. See what it does. The test. And then uh, we'll see if we have time to pop by the dyno and. Yeah. So after after we get that, as long as we have time, we'll go to the shop. We'll dyno it, and we'll uh, we'll give a full blown review. See what this thing can do. Awesome, man. <laughs> All right, guys. Today's been absolutely crazy. We drove the freaking twenty brand new twenty twenty Supra seven hundred miles from Georgia down to Bradenton Motorsports Park. Uh, we had a blast. We, uh, Nick and I got to be the first two, from what we believe, at least the first two to take the new Supra down the quarter mile. Uh, so that was really awesome, dude. High five. So cool, dude. Awesome freaking so day. Uh, so that's a wrap for tonight. We're actually throwing uh, Mickey Thompson drag reels <laughs> on the Supra first thing in the morning, and we're heading straight back to the track. So stay tuned. Yeah.